black scientist made discoveries so revolutionary that white scientists rejected them for 50 years. What? In the 1920s, Ernest Everett Just was peering through microscopes, making breakthroughs that would change biology forever. While other scientists fixated on the cell's nucleus, Just discovered something shocking. The cell's surface actually controls fertilization and development. This was earth-shattering. It completely overturned how we understand life itself. But American universities wouldn't hire him because of his race. Nobel Prize winner Thomas Hunt Morgan called Just's work groundbreaking, but racism still blocked his career. So Just was forced to conduct his revolutionary research in Europe, where scientists treated him like a celebrity and begged him to expand his theories. His work on cell membranes was decades ahead of its time. He discovered the fast block to polyspermy and proved that the cell's outer layer, the ectoplasm, controls development, concepts that form the foundation of modern fertility treatments and cancer research today. The theories that white American scientists dismissed in the 1920s weren't accepted until the 1970s. 50 years later, they finally admitted he was right. Now every biology student worldwide learns Ernest Just's principles as fundamental science. The man who couldn't get hired at American universities became the backbone of modern cellular biology. His rejected genius revolutionized how we understand life itself. Share this if your school books missed that part and follow for more history that changes how we see the past.